I have no idea how long this video is going to be because it's about one of those details that I've noticed that a lot of people have noticed before that I frankly wouldn't be surprised if there somehow happened to be more to it. But I think it's a fun little topic to take a look at and so in today's video that is exactly what we're going to be doing. In chapter 4 there's a mission called the Fine Night of Debauchery where Arthur, Javier, Josiah Trelawney and Leopold Strauss rob a ferry. They manage this by cheating at poker, but that's really not what I'm here to talk about. The ill-gotten win allows the gang access to the safe, inside which we'll find a fair bit of money alongside a Reutlinger pocket watch. After that, naturally, we went back down to join the rest of the party, and from there it goes completely tits up. After the present members of the gang escape, Leopold Strauss confirms that this is indeed a Reutlinger pocket watch. And this watch, uh, apparently it's worth a bunch of uh, Swiss. Uh... Reutlinger or something? Nice watch. Yes, it's a Reutlinger, all right. <laughs> we'll give it back then. I don't know why I've got a few shots of the strange man's house in here, but I thought it would be cool for some atmosphere. Anyway, you can equip this pocket watch. Once you do, you can open it from the tools wheel. You'll quickly notice that the numbers are in Roman numerals. However, there is something that's a little off here. Instead of there being an eight in the eight spot, it says 13. That could very easily be a mistake, but knowing Rockstar's track record for attention to detail, I'm quite doubtful of that. I don't know why the thing is seemingly vibrating in Arthur's hand. I assume that's a glitch. Now I looked at another pocket watch in the game that has also got Roman numerals on the face, that one being the gold pocket watch. In the 8 spot on that face it actually says 8. However being an I and a V in the 4 spot it's just 4 I's. However both technically mean 4. However old pocket watches with Roman numerals did actually tend to do that. The Reutlinger actually uses an I and a V in the 4 spot, however in the 8 spot it just says 13. Now my argument against the 13 being a styling choice as well is it says a completely different number, and I simply cannot imagine the value in reading 13 o'clock, although it could just very well be an unusual styling choice. However of all the numbers to switch out for 8, 13 is quite a curious choice. Naturally I sat here for a while watching the hands go around to see if anything would happen, and nothing did. One thing I did notice about the number 13 is it is considered by a lot of people to be synonymous with bad luck. For some form of religious reasons I presume, but that's by the by. But an out of place number in Roman numerals is very vague. Replacing the 8 with a 13 is curious, but I can't really pinpoint what it means. So naturally, like you do with all things that you can't explain in this game, you take it to Mount Shan. You know, where the aliens chill. And yes, of course, it doesn't seem to be related. On subreddits and things I've seen people drawing connections between the Reutlinger watch and this compass-like structure you find atop Mount Shan. However, frankly I just cannot see how anyone's come to that conclusion. I think we are probably closer to what it actually means when talking about the number 13 being a bad omen. With the number 13 believed to be unlucky because, supposedly, during the Last Supper Judas, the disciple who betrayed Jesus, was the 13th to sit at the table. Or something along those lines, and who did Judas betray the great mighty big man to? Yeah, I was gonna say the Russians, but that would just not be true and would also be a different story entirely. It would definitely put an interesting take on the New Testament. But no, the answer I believe is the Romans. And the numbers on the face of this watch are Roman numerals. You're probably wondering why would there be religious omens in a game like Red Dead? Well, we've already established that there's more to this universe than what can be simply explained or understood. And while I've failed to see the direct correlation here, I wouldn't rule it out. But who's to say there's only one explanation for every strange thing that seems out of place? For all we know, this could just be a detail error from Rockstar, but Rockstar's no stranger to putting details in games that only the smallest minority will notice. It could be a play on the proverb 13 strikes of the clock, basically meaning that if one detail, proclamation, or process is wrong, then the accuracy of all previous related items could be called into question. Now I'm probably not doing the overly confusing definition justice, but in simple terms it's if you're wrong here, who's to say you haven't been wrong before? Or if you're bad now, who's to say that you haven't always been bad? And which character embodies that moral question in the story of Red Dead Redemption 2? All this is just my own interpretation, of course. So could this be a secret message to Arthur Morgan telling him what's to come? Or could the 13 instead of the 8 on the face of this pocket watch just be a dodgy design choice? Rockstar love their secret messages, but this one is so thin that even I don't know right now. Not to say that I'm an expert or anything, we all know that I'm secretly a baboon. Am I onto something or am I just being silly? 
silly and is this just nothing? Please let me know what you think down in the comments section. But I've put my brain to it and this is the best theory that I can come up with. But if I am anywhere near remotely correct about this, which I wouldn't necessarily put money on, it is a very clever little detail. And if it was a mistake, then it's a very happy accident as I've assigned meaning to it now. Of course, there's one last thing to do with this Reutlinger watch. Sell it to the fence. Only $150, you've got to be joking.